Alright guys, it's time to tear open this beast of a box. Looks like one box is all parts, and one's just the case, so I'm just gonna open the case. Right now. the corner inch bays and then two floppy bays. Looks like two USB ports. There's a giganto fan on the top. There's two fans on the back. supply goes on the bottom. I cut the wire. What's in this box? Probably screws and stuff. Ooh, I see a clear fan there. Oh, you know what? No, that's not upside down. It looks weird. No, that's right. That's right side up. It just looks funky. It's got a hole here, looks like, for the fan. Power supply is here. I've never seen it like this. I guess computers have changed a lot. Well, either case. Let's open the box and check this out. <laughs> Oh, uh, power supply cables looks like, and lots of screws! Alright, I'm gonna put 
those aside. All right, let's see what we need next. Get another box. Looks like the goods. the Intel Core i7 processor i7-950 is the uh, 1 gigabyte GDDR5 Radeon HD 5770 ATI video card Yes, Sapphire. There's my uh, red illuminating 550 watt power supply. Wow, then we got the flaming blade motherboard. Gigabytes of RAM. Very nice. Seven hundred fifty gigabyte. Um, so I guess it's seventy two hundred RPM Seagate hard drive. And that looks like it. Go ahead, Fox, no problem. Anyone can co-host. If you want to give some pointers or whatever, by all means, join the call. It's been a while since I've done this, so it'll be a while. The processor speed, let me look. There's also a link on my Facebook. Um, all the specs of the computer. There's a screenshot. It's a quad core. It just says quad core. I don't see a megahertz thing, Bobby. Foxy? Yeah. There you go, Aksha. There we go. New computer, huh? Exciting. Yep. It was here. I was just sitting on my doorstep when I got back from class. I was surprised that you did that. I thought for sure I'm going to have to sign something. Yeah, you usually do. Maybe whoever shipped it is just wired. Here's the motherboard. Wow. Very colorful. Oh look, initial D. You should unmute now. All the gadgets in here. We got the SATA cables. 
Power cable. There he is. Yeah, sorry, just had to set up. Installation disk. Book. I'll need this later, not right now. Let's open up this baggie. What's up, guys? Hey, initial. How's it going there, Tom? I'm happy now. <laughs> I bet. Lucky punk. Yeah, it looks great. <laughs> Did you say the um, power supply has an LED? Yeah, it, it illuminates red. The case illuminates blue. <laughs> <laughs> We should make a cancerous computer. <laughs> it's already pretty cancerous with those colors. Just the motherboard. And Tom, are you sure that case is the right way? It, you know what? Well, I don't know <laughs> what this is up here. There's no way this could sit flat here. Yeah, that would be bad because the power it's the power to... supply when I have airflow. Yeah, what is that thing? Because these look like the expansion uh, ports from the motherboard. The motherboard screws back there. Yeah. You think this is the top? This is the front of the computer? Maybe they rotated the motherboard. I don't think so. Then you'd have holes in the top of your computer. Well, there's holes on all sides of this computer. There's one way to solve it. Where are the bays on the front? Or like the CD-ROM drive? Right is it on the top? They're right there. Well, then it's, it's oh, right it side up. Right I see the two floppies here, and then the four five and a quarters there. That tells yep, me it's the front. Yeah, that's right, though. It looks Isn't right. I mean, it looks awkward, but it's right. I've, I've honestly never seen a power supply on it's the bottom. It's a little either. strange, yeah. Me either. Yeah, you're right, then. So this motherboard has, um, from what I can see, eight USB ports, two Ethernet ports, looks like. A sound card. Yeah, looks like. I'll right. shove it in there. Put the, put the parts in. I'll lay the board down. Actually, I'm gonna read about yeah. the CPU. Just remember not to fry any of the parts. <laughs> yeah, you gotta make sure you're grounded. Yeah, I'm fine. Okay. No, it's not a fake. It looks pretty Intel to me. <laughs> it's like the box to me. It's a huge box for a CPU. Yeah. Probably most of its. Oh papers. yeah, I forgot about the fan and the heatsink. That's the whole box. <laughs> oh yeah, that. Yeah. Thing. Holy crow! Look at this thing. It has to have that. Looks like something from Half Life 2 or something. <laughs> little face hugger. Here's the head core, core right there. Metal head thread. There you go. Oh, there it is. I hope this came with thermal paste. I don't see it. Usually you have to, it's already on there, and you just have to peel a little, like, um... Oh, really? Oh, I see What are they that. called? Oh, it's got you nice. see it? Yeah. So I just put it on like that? Good deal. Yep. That's one less thing I have to worry about. Yeah, they started doing that now, because people hated the thermal paste. Nobody knew how to do it right. Yeah, my motherboard came with a uh, 
it came with a processor attached and in the case, the case was free, so I don't know anything about right, that mount too CPU much. First. Get that out oh, of okay. Way. Yeah, first steps is always the CPU. Like they made it awesome. Alright. Now, the CPU can only go one way. Yep. I'll just push it until I make it fit. Don't push it too hard. <laughs> it, it should go right in. <laughs> it's well, the ramp. one direction, I'll just have. turn it and then push it again. If it doesn't fit that way, then I'll push it again. Yeah, it, it's the ram where we're gonna need a little bit yeah. of muscle. Yeah, I know it's key, and I'm just being, just being silly. Oh, okay, sorry. Die, monster! You don't belong in this world! There's no pins! What? It's flat. Look at it. Huh. I've never seen that before. No, not even my uh, AMD was like that. Okay, I see the notch. Let me line it up with the board. Yep. Pin, so it makes it even harder. <laughs> it says before installing the CPU, make sure to turn off the computer and unplug the power cord. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Check pin 1 marking triangle with a pin 1 corner of the CPU socket align the CPU notches with the socket alignment keys and gently put the CPU on the socket. Okay, it doesn't show you where that is. Yes, diagrams are key. Yeah, it doesn't say like, um, there isn't like a 1 anywhere on the, the chip. Dual laser says, jam it in there with a hammer. <laughs> oh. It goes one of two ways, but there's nothing. I need the manual uh, says pin one goes here. Let me get the manual up here because I I haven't installed the i7 before. This is very easy. Right, 1.21 gigawatts on the side of the case. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, Guru would know what to do here. Does, um... Hold on. He's probably lurking. Guru, get in here. 
It can only go one of two ways. I'm not, I'm, yeah, I'm not gonna take any chances. Could you, um... Yeah, could you put the chip, um... Like, in the webcam? So I can see it? Yeah. Thank you. No, I'm I'm sorry, the CPU. Oh. Uh, both sides would help. Yeah. I don't think that's because you would, uh, place it face down, of course. Ah, I see it now. Getting the manual up here. I found it. Here, look. Oh, you found it. Oh, you do? Yep. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, then. That's definitely the way to do it, then. King Sport, it's not dangerous unless you plug the power supply in and then lick it. <laughs> well, the only thing dangerous right now is if you're not grounded while you're touching it's fine. the yeah. processor, but it's fine. All you really need to do is touch the computer chassis and then you can work with anything at yep. that point. CPU should be mounted, it looks kind of wobbly. Though. I said processor, I meant CPU. Whatever. Looks like the fan just screws into the motherboard. The heat sink? Yep. Okay. That's right. Let me locate the power supply for this thing. Usually you have to install that fan first and you won't have you won't be able to put the power in yet. Just make sure it's mounted to your motherboard. I don't think it matters how it goes as long as it reaches the power point. I think it's right there. Looks like that's it. Yep, okay, so yeah. we can put it there. Classic Nintendo video game. It's the adventures of Super Mario Brothers 3. I better tell the princess. All right, they push through the motherboard. Episode collection now available on a 3D box. Should have put this on after I mount the motherboard in the case, because it needs room underneath the board. And this time, um, the Koopas I've seen people do it outside, yeah. and I've seen people do it on the inside. So it's up to Mario, Luigi, and uh, Princess Toadstool to save the um, day. The side with the uh, CPU on it. But uh, there's usually comes with little spacers. Like, between, you can put between the motherboard and the case, so the motherboard's not touching. Yeah, exactly, because if it's on the table here, it's flush with the table. Yeah. All right, I think I'll wait and put that on after get the motherboard in the case. 
got you need some give us under should yeah Here's the mounting bracket for the I.O. What the hell is this? What's what? This thing. Is that an expansion port? Like, um... Express... PCI? It looks like a... Something. It looks like it. Yeah, it's just floating there. I have a lot of reading to do. That sounds a completely different motherboard. Yeah, this is a lot different from what I'm used to. Alright, I got lots and lots and lots and lots of screws. Yeah, that's that's never changed. You should have <laughs> plenty of screws. <laughs> Oh god. I've just oh been god. informed that this monitor that I'm using right now was in use on a Windows 95 machine. <laughs> Bit trivia for ya. Yeah, the shadow. The, the, no, the case doesn't tell me which holes I need oh. for the motherboard. Usually it's marked with an A for ATX. I doubt it's every single one I'm looking for. Are they located on the bottom of the case? No, they're not. Install your RAM. Okay. Your motherboard was called a flaming sword, right?
Hmm, yeah, you do have two Ethernet ports. I'm gonna punch out some of these spots if they're on my board. Wait, let me see what you're punching out first. Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah, the hard drive. Is that what you're talking about? Yep. So that's definitely fine. What? What's wrong? Huh? No, no, I was just saying that's fine. I, I thought you were punching out something else. I was like, uh... No, I wouldn't punch it. My <laughs> No, and... Never mind. <laughs> Whatever. Whoa. No, he's gonna. He's gonna take to a drill. He's gonna put holes in his case. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. That's what it sounded like. I was like, um. <laughs> okay, I'm still trying to find this diagram for your motherboard here. Yeah, that's how mine is. Okay, let's see. One, two, three, four. Monstrous fans right in front of the CPU. It's ridiculous. I'm a little scared. At least you don't have to worry about overheating. Yeah, well, I I have three fans pointed at my CPU. Jeez. Me, and my motherboard. So it looks a little ridiculous. And one of my fans is like multicolored LED. <laughs> looks like a freaking rainbow. Double rainbow. <laughs> you don't want this rainbow. I bet your oh, computer's loud. No, it's pretty quiet. Maybe I'll get you a rainbow LED fan for your birthday, Tom. That would be awesome! <laughs> I will enjoy it, I promise. Yeah, he can make his computer learn to love. And it can match his Wii. No, in order for that to happen, I'll have to get a plastic case. <laughs> I'm surprised this That's case it. isn't labeled. 
Mine wasn't, I don't think. Mm, mine was labeled. I was able to get everything started up pretty quick. Yeah. Oh, Frodo, hey. get out of here. Hey, Frodo. Frodo! How goes the building of the PC? It's okay. We got, we're, on a, we're on a good start now. Every time I look, somebody sent me an email. It wasn't me. It wasn't me. What do they want on the forums? Hello, guys. So I've been playing a, a bookworm adventures. Oh yeah? It didn't let me spell Oreo. Yes, ah, it's not a word. It doesn't submit your scores online, does it? No. Well then they should let you have your own dictionary. Jeez, Tom, there like exists no diagrams for your motherboard. I know, it's ridiculous. <laughs> the manual's freaking thick, too. Oh. That'd be helpful. <laughs> okay, I think that's all I can really find out here. Alright, I got... One, two, three. I got nine... Mounting screws. That should be more than enough. Alright, I guess we'll install the RAM next. Yep. Now we see three RAM slots. I only have two. Two fours, I think they are. It's Corsair RAM, I've never heard of them. XMS Me either. <laughs> yes, how is Buddy? There's one. Empty one. Oh. Alright, let's look at the RAM on the board. I'm gonna refresh this RAM real quick. <laughs> Installing the memory. Make sure you turn off your computer. Check. There should be just like a latch on the side. Okay, there's the a RAM slot. Like... Alright, I just need to know which ones are 1 and 2. It's usually closest to the CPU, right? From, what do you mean, 1 to 2 to 3? Yeah. Uh, yes. Alright, then I think we're good. Ooh, it's got a nice cover. Very sexy. <laughs> and it'll never go back to that cover ever again. <laughs> But there be power. Wow, these don't snap. 
Yeah, usually the RAM doesn't do that. Should, but all memory I've installed, I've always snapped. Really? I've yeah. never had that before. <laughs> saying you'd have trouble putting it in? Or was uh, that the Well, I was going to put it in the case first. Oh, uh, okay. Let me try that. That should be fine. You just gotta be careful with it, though. Since it's not going to be flat against the surface. I hated installing the thing, because you have to put so much pressure on the board. <laughs> for the fan. See, Oreos are not accepted, but Gookie is. What? Still playing platform adventures. Oh. Uh, Apparently, Gookie is acceptable. What's that? What is Gookie? You know what Gook is? You know, like, the... do come with them. Yeah, there's like a little metal oh, there you go. piece underneath it. They're definitely yeah. not in this box. Look at me, I'm building my CPU. Play online with all my friends at home. Yay! Maybe rain. 
hippo, unicorn pack. Chimera hunt. Chimera hunt. Don't give me a reason to buy oh. games on Steam. What? Uh, all I said was that it gives me a reason to buy games on Steam. Yes, it does. No hey, I'll actually be able to click Two, the invite three, to game button. Four. It's just not used to it. <laughs> Alright, this is who the big ones. Enough. That's fine. I'll give it to you small if you want that one. <laughs> Insert a new window here. Yeah. Yes. This one likes some small. That's right, Jay. Oh wow, that's a tricky one. Well, what's wrong? Ooh, but I got her. to Super Mario Brothers 1, 25th birthday yesterday. Oh, I know. <laughs> Draw some case none of you guys were here, or anybody in the chat. <laughs> Just I totally played Mario games yesterday. 
Me too. Sure. I even played Mario T just typing. Nice. That's a nice way to celebrate. It's a fun one. A little education, never hurt anyone. I think Mario wants you to learn. I played, I tried playing Mario is missing, but I couldn't get past the first level. Uh huh. Annoyed with you. You're pulling out the big one? Yep. This one likes the big one. one likes the... I bet it does. Sometimes. Alright, we got <laughs> one. As long as it's um, you know snug in there and won't move at all. Oh, she ain't going anywhere. All right. It's looking good on my end. Yep. It's disgustingly beautiful. All right. So next, what do you think? The CPU thing. Yeah, we might as well get that on. Yeah, they're all different. <laughs> they're all different. Like, every walkthrough I've, I've seen had you manually put the thermal paste on. Yeah, 
<laughs> no, I, I don't think they have you manually put that on anymore. Yeah, there's no text, it's just pictures. I like pictures. It's multilingual. Yeah. It's no lingual if, it, if it's no language in it. It's so easy, even a caveman could do it. If he had knowledge of PCs. <laughs> All of text. I... I think you're right, though. It looks like that's how it goes. And you just twist each one individually? E I, I can't give you an accurate answer just yet. Yeah, hold up here. that they're secure. Start up the computer, the BIOS will tell us what's going on. Yeah, exactly. that's right. Most of them. They'll yell at you. And did you plug in the fans in the motherboard? It's 
hands plugged in. Okay. Alright, what's the next order of business? Uh, the next one would probably be... Should I put the hard drive in? I guess. No, we might want to leave that one for last. Okay. When we, when we have the power supply in. But you may want to actually put in the video card. Video card. Okay. Here's our beast of the video card. Sapphire 1 gigabyte. It's monstrous. VR, Radeon HD 5778. Better than mine, Better I only be. have the 4770. This card's so huge, it takes up two slots. What? It's yeah. crazy. So if you wanted uh, duels, then you'd pick up uh, four slots. Yeesh. I don't. I, I'm fine with my 4770, but I, I know people who want to do it. Wow, this is Stop, you must connect this graphics board to your computer power supply. Really? No kidding. Are you freaking serious? That's Just in case you crazy. didn't know that I needed electricity. Alright, here's the video card. Someone's got a whistle mic. Um, I don't think it's on my end. I think it is. Oh well, who cares? Is it? It's got two HDMI. Two HDMI's, okay. And it's crazy awesome. Yeesh. Alright, there's two different expansion ports this would fit in. I'm guessing the one again closest to the CPU is where it should go. One of the red ones. I'm just gonna look it up real quick. Yeah. Oh, if it, it doesn't work, it'll matter, be pretty evident. Probably uh, usually ATI cards will uh, pick the first available. Oh wait, no, we're not talking about that. Never mind. I'm mixing up cards with monitors. Get out of here. <laughs> Alright, yeah, it looks like it's the one closest to it. Because I need the PCI ports for my sound card. Yeah, I believe you're right just from looking at a picture of him. Gentlemen, shall we?
the video chat. Aw, Trident sent me Left 4 Dead 2 on Steam. Yeah. That's awesome. Love you already there. I don't have Left 4 Dead 2. Thank you, Trident. I need to get that game now. Big thanks, Trin. How much does it usually go for? I don't know, let me load. Okay. Right. Twenty bucks, okay. That's not bad at all. I'm looking at the heating coil under the video card, it's like... Mm -hmm. It's like one inch diameter. <laughs> yep. Wow, that really takes up a lot of space in the motherboard. Yeah. Good thing I only need one PCI slot. Yep. Um, what's next? Or power supply, maybe power supply? Uh, power supply, yes. Anyone who missed it? A 550 watt power supply, which glows red. Has fatality red. on the side. Because you so needed your power supply to light up. I don't know. Just. Just in case you forget where it is. <laughs> now, uh, Super take it apart. Just when you spill it over your power supply in the go. dark. <laughs> Plug it in, take it apart, and then touch the transformer. <laughs> That's really smart, isn't it? I want to see if it's bigger than mine. Let's compare sizes there. I hear that from you a lot, Mission. I know. Indeed. The bigger the better. Yes, put it in. Cable or anything? Who's this bigger initial? I'm waiting for it. Delay. Still don't see it yet. I do. Jesus. Hold on, let me refresh. Oh, there we go. Er, put it back in. Oh, I'm Kim. Oh. I think mine's bigger. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, you got the bigger video card. We'll set on this later. Mm. Initials power supply is just bad. Mine doesn't even like really need that much, but it eats too much. Data and power cables are now just not ribbons anymore. They're all bound into like a real cable. I love that. Yeah. Alright, we're gonna mount the power supply. Let's do it. Is that a train in the background? Yep. Does it have a... In my case. I had to put my DVD drive on the bottom bay. 
Does it have an opening on the case? There it goes. Yeah, it's got an opening right here. Oh, you can't really see it. Hold on. Yeah. There's, an, there's a grid right here. And a fan on the... Oh, okay. Right there. Okay. Yeah, mine... Well... Oh, man. Mine's on top, so... That's how all computer parts are. Well, to be fair, in the old days, it wasn't this complicated. No. <laughs> yeah, but in the old days, computers used the whole room and only be as powerful as a calculator. Yeah. That's true. They had all kinds of gears and vacuum tubes. Now I've got motors and fans. Mm -hmm. And tons of silicone. You kids and your Blu-rays and your... Just like my women. <laughs> what? Fatality because it kills your computer. Because <laughs> it finishes your computer. <laughs> yes, finally. Thank. Trust me, your beast will need it. Swear at it. What I do when I want it. Uh, <laughs> there are kids in the room, Tom. Can't really say that. It's rejecting it. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen such a thing. Well, when a woman says no. Be it. <laughs> How many power supplies have you, have you met? Yes, we have Scrooge! <laughs> now we are Good going. times then. Yes, after plenty of fighting. <laughs> after plenty of fighting, he gets a lot of Scrooge. Awesome. <laughs> Just emphasizing that you have a loud keyboard. No, you guys just have loud speakers. Get 
Yeah, Laser, you get to see his product key and everything. This power supply is mounted. Yeah. Yeah. Hurrah! So, have you got a way to? Damn it! Yeah, the phone part is coming. You can do that now. Okay. Do you have any way to uh, capture direct monitor output from your computer? No. So we're gonna ghetto stream it. Driver in from the back and push him out there. Yeah. Should just pop right out. And then store them somewhere where you'll forget them, so that in the future, when you're installing new drives, you'll be wondering, where's my covers? to pop out one of them, so... Yeah. Looks like they changed that on us. Not even a picture manual? That's lame. Get a torch and cut it out. <laughs> now use the blow torch. Can you pop it from the side of the case, huh? Well, if it breaks when you try to push it out, you weren't going to use it anyway. <laughs> At least yeah. I'm not. I don't see a reason why you would want to just get rid of a CD-ROM drive, so... Super glue. <laughs> yeah, that's it. <laughs> it looks like wire foot right <laughs> Hmm? Oh, excuse me, I just pulled it out of your Oh. And it didn't hit the cam, so. <laughs> Oh yeah. god. <laughs> They're making bad jokes in the chat now. Oh yeah, I knew that was coming. <laughs> One half their <laughs> they've made good jokes in the chat. Hey, why didn't it censor Al? Is it? <laughs> it 
censored me when I say cockpit. I wonder why. <laughs> of course I hyphenated. it. So it's like... Oh god. Yes? <sighs> Look what Al said. <laughs> Alright, I literally just went out and ripped the computer in the living room. From the old living room. What are you gonna do? W. Ooh. Dual layer. Oh crap. Dual yeah. layer. Yeah. All you need to do is throw in Blu-ray burner in your cane. You know the Blu-ray when you can get HD Are the uh, rails in the back blocking it or something? <sighs> Show that CPU's boss. There's screws mounted in there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I've never seen that before. Uh, you kind of see when I... Tom. Big shocker? Tom, the number one thing I don't want to hear when you're building the computer is, Whoa, i never seen that before. <laughs> it's not a good sign. <laughs> no, that's just something you don't want to hear during brain surgery. <laughs> Yeah. I've seen words. Yeah. Yeah, we like them that way. <laughs> it looks so discolored from the rest of the case. Submit our pictures of our computers, and then we like, could. We should, we should have started a thread on that. To the forums. I'm already there. <laughs> Why have you? I will put this under general discussion. No All right. I still like how did. What is this thing? I don't get it. I mean, what are you trying to do? Hey, Dark.
It's going well, Dark. Most likely the screws. You ain't going anywhere. You live in here. This is a very You. That would be next. Two hard drives are going in here. I got my what is this? A seven seven fifty gigabyte. Yes. I have a one terabyte data data drive from the D. So we'll have enough space for a lot of stuff. All right. They can go wherever, but usually you want to start from the top. Why is that bad? I don't know, it's just a habit. It, it could be go a bad habit. It could, but it's just a habit I have. Okay, where just, to install the hard drive? Um... Yeah, like I said, uh, it's probably the, the top one part. Seven different places I can put it. I think I'll put it down here so it's got air above and below it. Does that sound good? I like um, it. Well, the thing is, a hard drive doesn't really need air. Well, I don't want it flush up against the port above it. Okay. Well, it doesn't really, it doesn't really it, matter where it's situated as long as it's, uh, as long as it's stable and able and easily connected to the computer. Exactly. You go on any one you want. Oh, I see what you mean. Oh, what's this yeah, card? as long as it's hogging all the space. Well, I just saw his, um, the video card where it was, and so it's probably as easier to I'll look just at put it in the lower spot. Okay. But, uh, as long as, uh, What's up, B? Laptops are not pro. <laughs> they like Max, it's a paint upgrade. You don't upgrade Max, you just get another Mac. <laughs> Same thing goes for laptops. That's how they get their money. Yeah, through proprietary software. Get in there! Is there some more screws block in the way? Is there a screw in the back? No. Maybe it just got caught on the rail or something.
Hello. Tom? Tom? What? Hi. We're echoing up a storm. Get out. I'm what? Nothing. They're causing feedback. I'll stop being so loud. Yeah, that's a good idea. Ah! Alright, it's your fault. What do we do next? Cable, ID, ID cables, data cables, power cables. What's up? All we the cables. Those... Yeah, we want to get those uh, cables hey, down for the. Being a nerd. Stop being annoying. I know, Sam. I know. Uh, sorry, boot my sister. <laughs> oh, was that who it was? Yes. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I thought you turned into a woman for a second there. I don't know what that was. <laughs> What did we say about letting her out of her cage? But yeah, we definitely want to go. Oh, uh, okay then. Never mind. Anyways, we definitely want to go for cables. Say that for long, though. Yeah, this is gonna be a gaming PC soon. This is gonna be everything PC. PC. Alright, there's that. And your work PC. Is that your phone ringing? It is. You should tell him you're busy. I am. I'm busy. I'm so much nicer than me on the phone. Yeah, I turn all notifications on my phone off when I'm home. People should know that if they want to contact me, they should contact me where I am.
it sometimes supports a little further than you think. Just watch, when you get it all plugged in, within two days the wire fairy's gonna come and visit your house and tangle up every single cord behind your computer. in any fans like mine did. No, you know how you like, the have like the, the hard drive Four lights, the power lights, the power switch? Oh, oh, oh. oh that crap. And no manual. <laughs> I hated the fans on those. Mr. A comma has been hammered 150, 133 times. Keep it going. I still have no hate points. I don't know I do. the cutest couple. That was great. <laughs> that was really great. Kev. I missed that. <laughs> Wait, does, does Kev get two levels? Kev loves himself. <laughs> I knew it was conceited. Yeah, it means he gets two levels. What's wrong with it? There's no way, um... What I see... We should, uh, I think we should lay off the Bannon commands right now. <laughs> That'd be a good thing. You're all lagging it. Hey, Tom. Yeah? Do you know if uh, Steve will play uh, spooky games for October? Spooky games? I love spooky games. I think Tom's calling a monopoly for October. <gasps> Do it! What?
should go right in. Just not reach or no, uh, Tom? I didn't hear Tom. I didn't either. I don't think I can hear Tom. Nope. We're in big trouble now. Tom, are you uh, talking? Well, if you can't hear me, we're in big trouble. Well, this is a problem. Is it right if I see the end of that wire? Yeah. It's got a, a split here. I've never seen this before. But it's definitely an ATX connector. Mm -hmm. And it's got room for yeah. all the pins. And it's just not going in, or...? No, it's not keyed. Nothing's telling me where pin 1 is. Oh, now I see what you're getting at. Oh god. Give me one second before you do that. In 2012, the airships are coming. Is there a white wire with a red strip on it, Tom? That you can see? yellow on the end. Dang it. Oh wait, alright, I think I got it. You found it? Boomer! Ooh. 
where? I want one. The USB header, audio connector, speaker connector, front panel connector, reset switch, power LED, all this junk. What's with all the charging? Power switch. not match this board. What are we trying to do right now, Tom? Trying to connect the front panel, LEDs, power switch, reset button, hard drive light, all that stuff. Proto. Proto. Get a proto. that could happen is when you turn on your computer something turns on when it wasn't supposed to. They don't have it, uh... <laughs> is it like... Is it the, another 7 pin, or...?
the USB connector can be connected to the Foxconn Quantum Force OC channel. You can install any standard 5.25 optical drive bay. What the hell is this for? Nothing I'm going to use. Nope. Okay, so where is this mysterious front panel connector area? No, hold on, hold on, hold on. What's your motherboard's Please model number? Don't, don't go crazy yet. Alright. What's, what's the model number? Um, it's an X58. And what, flaming, what, uh... Flaming Blade. It's a box. That was above the, the ram. Oh, I don't even see it on this picture. Sit that one down there. I'm not kidding, initial, there's, there's nothing there. Is there anything under the uh, PCI slots? Um, like near the very end of the board? Yeah, yeah uh, it says... CD audio. Okay. SPDIF. And it goes okay. to the floppy connector.
Those ones fit fine. Yep. Then there's okay. the AC97 and the HD. Oh, it's the onboard audio. Yeah, I believe so, Tom. Found the second um, case fan adapter. Plug that in. Well, they forgot to put him on. <laughs> no, I don't think so. Yeah, sorry, this is taking a while. It's just really hard finding information on this line. done away with internal speakers? Uh, from what I know, yeah, they have. Okay. No more beeps or anything? Nope. Wow. Yeah, I haven't heard an internal speaker in a while. Huh. Yep. Well, everything, everything else is done. We're just waiting for this, uh... Damn. Bounce. For this? I'm not sure. Okay, watch. I'm gonna show you this. In the manual. Okay. In the manual. Okay. Now, when I pull out yeah. a big old map picture from the board. Okay. There's the memory. Okay. 
this says it's right down there. And it is! It's all colorful and pretty. Hurrah! Wow. That's, yeah, that's, where, nice. that's where I was asking you to check. <laughs> I was. I was not looking for rainbow colors. Oh, okay. Alright. Well, now we found it. Unbelievable. So they got it wrong, then. Yeah. Interesting. Now, which one's clean one? Which one's positive, which one's negative? That should be the red... It should have, like, a red strip on the wire. Yep, but I meant on the board itself. Or the negative. Or the negative and positive. Shouldn't be one big thing. Well, the worst thing is, it won't light up, or it won't come Crap. not match up at all. I don't know what to believe. Empty. Alright, it says the power positive is the top left. I'm gonna go with it. So wait, they separated the positive and the negative, but like, far away from each other? No, the positive is plugging into the yellow part. It should be blue. You know? I think mine was yellow. I remember correctly. I thought it was rainbow colored, so it, it would be easy to identify where the... Hard drive light, which is red, resets orange, usually. Power switch is blue, and the power LED is green. Just not following that. Whatever. Yeesh. Colors. Colors give me a headache. It is. They're all... It is different from mine, definitely. I know it's a different brand, but yeah. whatever. Did we find out what goes where? <laughs> it's being kind of a pain. Well, if it doesn't turn on, we know why. <laughs> or if the lights don't light up. Which is not a big right. deal. Yeah. No, or if the fan turns on for a second. Yeah. There are two things that should just get power right away when it turns on power light and the uh, fan. Fan soon. So I think either way you connect those, they're gonna work somewhat.
Deja. Nothing. <clears throat> deja vu, but. Major deja vu. This moment in time. SP is the game. It's 237 King Fair Day. Power supply? Yeah. Uh, I, I believe the four pen goes into the motherboard. Again, I'm just going on a, uh, a big picture of the motherboard. And that's it. <laughs> okay. Let me switch back over here. Yeah. ATX 12 volt power. The one. Okay, is it on the top right, you said? Yeah, next to the I.O. port. Oh, I.O. port, sorry, one second here. Where's that picture? That is a I, I, right above the right next to the IO, like you said. So it's an eight pin. That's weird. I don't see. It, it has to be good though. Yeah, you know what, Tom, I, I'm pretty sure that's the... Okay, the one problem is, the cable doesn't really reach up there.
So the cable's not reaching then, Tom? No, I'm looking at the power supply um, manual. Where am I going to see? Okay. Connect the PCIe connector to the gra- Oh, right, we need to pull it on the graphics card. Yep. Um, alright, what is that? It's about everything I need Three pin. You know what I don't understand? What would that be, Fox? If Toad knows that Peach is not in the castle, then why doesn't he tell Mario before he gets to the castle? Because he's inside the castle sure. looking ahead. Toad's a scout. Scout is spy. Left on. Yeah, one end has eight, the other end has three. I'm guessing that goes into the. Yeah, and it says PCI Express on the cable, so I'm guessing that's for the graphics card. Yes. Alright, let me do that one first. Luckily, we have the same type of graphics card, so we're at least. Yeah. At least have instruction there. What would Gordon Freeman do if he were in uh, the Mushroom Kingdom at the time that Mario was going through Super Mario Brothers? He'd use his crowbar. Yeah, he just whacked the Goombas. And then he pulls rifle Bowser in the face. Alright, graphics card is plugged in. Did we get the motherboard? Motherboard's plugged in. Yep. Oh, oh. Plugged in. Hard drive's plugged in. Yep. Hard drive power's not in yet, but I'll just do it. Oh, wait, no, that's, okay. that's in, because that's, um... What do you call it? Static drive. Oh, okay. Um, and I see your wrong drive. drive. We need more power! Looks like it. That's a good question. What game are you gonna play on it first? I don't know. Robot Unicorn Attack, duh. <laughs> yeah, do be. that one. Ask. Well, I think. Alright, I'm gonna run the C. I need to do this. I'm gonna run the C drive and the hard drive off of two separate power cables. I'm gonna do that. Yeah, that's fine. Usually do it.
time for the Banhammer challenge. It's just not allowed this tonight. It's Paradox Zero. Go, go, go. It still looks like a mess, though. They still have IDE drive support. Really? Oh, of course. Corresponding connections on the PSU. Okay. 
you're not using that, uh, so. It says... Yeah, ATX 12 volt power connection. Okay, connection. That's what it says on the board itself. I don't know exactly what that I better see this viewer count rise in the next five minutes. Thank you. We got the powers. We, are so we got the power so supply and everything. Oh. Uh, the what are we forgetting here? Isn't the um uh, Isn't it on board? It is on board, but it's got these uh front jacks on the case. It's it's the case itself, so it might not have it on the board. Oh. There it is, front audio connector. <laughs> That's mean. We have an option for using <laughs> HD audio and AC97. I'm going to use the AC97. Just because I think I know what that means. Because I've been using it. Not. Whatever. Yeah, I'm not too used. I don't know what the two differences between those. I think HD audio is only supported by certain speakers. Oh. As long as they don't have a power supply here, sir. CX power connect connector power two. Alright, that's done. Turn the page. Eight pin ATX 12 volt power connector power one. The eight pin ATX 12 volt power supply connects to power one and provides power to the CPU. Okay, we kinda need that, don't we? Yeah, we kinda do. We recommend you using an 8-pin ATX 12-volt power supply. If you are using a 4-pin power supply, you need to align the ATX power connector according to the picture to the... Yeah, that's running. I think that's running. Have the 8-pin? Okay. Yeah, didn't we already do So this? it's all in order? Okay. I thought we already got the power going. We did. It says there's a second one. Second one? Yeah, the, the manual says PWR2, which is the big 24 pin power that we connected before. Yeah. And then it says the 8 pin ATX 12 volt power for power 1 provides power to the CPU. Interesting. There's a cable coming right off the power supply. And it's got eight pins. I'm guessing, I'm hoping that's for that connector. And it looks like it is, but it doesn't reach quite that. Well. Like, it doesn't really reach at all. 
Says it's the power for the CPU. I guess we should hook it up. Well, at least you don't need to worry about hooking up vacuum tubes. It doesn't reach. There's no way it's gonna reach. It's Weber's birthday. I don't think we need it, but if it, if it says it's a necessity, if it's... So Express cables the same thing. Mm. So that doesn't look like it wants to reach either. What are you guys two plus two wing? This reaches. Um, I don't know if I should go ahead and just connect it. Let me look at well. the pin out. The right to the, the the rightmost pins are grounded. The rest are yellow. Okay. No more than 12 volts is going to come out of this thing, right? No. When it says 12 volts, it means 12 volts. Yeah, this one's the opposite of what it's supposed to be. I don't know if I trust it. Base. That's all I worry about. 
waves like right over it. Yeah. Eesh. It's got to go here. Can you see it in the case? No, I can't really see it. See it now? One sec here. Let me try to bring a light over. It's, yeah, I need a light. <laughs> That should be fine. I, I thought you meant like it was like going through the fan or something. I was like, uh. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I don't actually know what the heck this does. I don't even know if it's scan or more. Which part? <laughs> Oh. You got me on that one. Did that come with the uh, motherboard? Yeah, it came with the motherboard. It doesn't go over the chip or anything, does it? That's what I'm looking at. Okay, well, I guess we'll assume. <laughs> Alright, I think we're all together, and now we just need to tidy up the case, because it looks like a goddamn disaster. <laughs> Did you see the wire mask? Look at this. Yep, I'm looking at it. <laughs> Can I put it as cleanly as I could? Alright. Oh. Twist tight, though, your mask. Yes. Yeah, case. that's what I did. I didn't. Uh, well, I had no choice. I had to use them to keep them away from the fans. Yeah, that's like worried about. Yeah, that's like... Last computer I had, I heard like the mm -hmm. wires, like, it's not like a saw blade going through wood. Because one of the wires <laughs> went into the like, CPU fan. Yeah, that's about how it sounds for me, yeah. too. <laughs> you get to buy new that wires. Was horrible. Okay. I'll install Windows first. That'd be a good idea. Well, you should probably check your BIOS first. Yep. You can help me with that. Okay, okay. Sounds like a good idea. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
All right, I think it's time to close her up. Let's see if we did it. Yeah, let's see if it blows up now. Oh, I forgot yeah, the uh, I glowing fan. Oh no. Ooh. Let me get that. Ah, uh, shiny. <laughs> Pretty sure that one's just faux show, but whatever. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's close to anybody. <laughs> anyway, lights are cool, anyways. They are. Every fan inside mine is a lady. Connected. All right. I hope this uh, works. Yeah, yeah don't close it. So just too. start it up. Everything looks okay. All right, let's close it up. Yeah, oh, like Foxtrot, like Foxtrot said, maybe we shouldn't close it up just yet. I'll put the sign on. Okay. There we go. Alright, let's take a look at that. I'll have to install my sound card somewhere. I'll do that after I install mm -hmm. those, I think. Okay. Power supplies down on the on the bottom. I've never bottom. seen that before. <laughs> I've always known it to be at the top. Mm -hmm. I've never had one like that. Oh, what's this about? On the top of the case, it's got this flap. Flap that opens. Let's see. Oh! It's got two USB and the headphones. Oh, now I see. Yep, snap snazzy. The cables come out here. You can keep your headphones and the microphone. So you can close the Oh, sweet. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Boo! You're done? Alright. Huzzah? Now we just need to plug it in. 